You're watching the Valley's most accurate forecast on 8 News Now. No air conditioning. That's going to be tough. Uh, well, you can see this is our Rio Cam pointed east. And the heavier cloud cover is to our east. It's 107 out at Reed, top of the hour. Humidity 13% for the big threat. The dew point 46 degrees. They'd kill for that in Atlanta. But for us, you can kind of, you know, you, you can kind of feel the humidity. A wind south at uh, 17 miles an hour, top of the hour. 109 is the unofficial high today, which is four above normal. It, it sure beats the upper teens. And 90 was our low, and that's way above our normal. 114 and 62 are the records. Currently, temperatures uh, about as cool as it gets at Summerlin Roads Ranch at 104, but they're hanging 108, uh, East Las Vegas, Nellis, Anthem 106, and to the north, Aliante, also a 106. It's 99 in Indian Springs, 103 in Pahrump, and 109, East, a little toasty over in eastern Clark County, 110 down in the Colorado River Valley. We have the potential for severe thunderstorms moving into the upper Mississippi Valley and the Hudson Valley as well. Meanwhile, for us, this is, we're keeping an eye to our east. That's the steering mechanism in the atmosphere that high. And it's going to move around this week. And depending uh, where it moves, that's how it's going to steer the moisture. So I think you're going to want to watch the weather every day this week because the, the forecast is subject to change in terms of our precipitation probability. Uh, we had some showers up in the mountains today. We've got some more stuff moving up to 95. It looks like it's falling apart before it would threaten the southeast valley. So clearing and hazy at times during the wee hours of the morning. Uh, an evening thunderstorm is possible, but the chance for that will diminish uh, markedly at uh, sunset. 109 tomorrow, uh, about the same as today with the morning sun, and then you'll see some more clouds in the afternoon. There is an afternoon thunderstorm possible. The best chance, though, is definitely to our south and uh, to our east. Uh, 8 a.m., 93. If you want double digits, get out early because by noon we're going to be well into triple digits. About 107, partly sunny at 3 p.m. And then by 8 p.m., sunset will be at 105. Southerly winds 5 to 10. Of course, if there's a thunderstorm, they will increase. Tomorrow's highs ranging from 105 in Summerlin to 110s on the east side of the valley and across the region, 110 in Mesquite, 104 in Prim, 113 in Lofton. Here's your eight-day most accurate forecast. And uh, I'll keep a 20% chance for some showers tomorrow afternoon in the forecast. And then some more morning sun, increasing clouds on Wednesday, a little more sun on Thursday. But look at that weekend forecast. That's where we're getting in the 110 to 115 range again. And that's kind of tough to take, though we will cool off a few degrees going into next week. Now that's it for weather. Stay tuned because 8 News Now at 4 continues after the break.